Hey y'all, welcome back to the new video. I'm actually gonna be unpacking, cleaning, and doing a grocery haul all in this one video. So if y'all are interested, stay tuned. Hey y'all, so I got a lot of positive vibes from the last video. Y'all said that y'all like these types of videos, so I guess I will show y'all how I unpack and clean up my kitchen. I do have to go to the commissary sometime today. So I wanted to come back to a clean kitchen so I could put stuff away and start the week um, off right. So yeah, y'all are gonna see me unpack my kitchen, um, clean my kitchen, and decorate a couple of things. I did go ahead and put some stuff up there. That's when I was unpacking stuff last week, but I kind of like it up there now, so we'll scan that up there at the end, but um, yeah, so since I know y'all are interested in these videos, enjoy y'all.
Okay guys, so I cleaned the kitchen for the most part, but the issue that I'm having is I got my little done display right here. It has my birdhouse and stuff on it. But yeah, um, I realized that if you turn the corner from the front door, you're gonna hit your head. Um, so I'm gonna actually move it up here above this utility door. And we're gonna actually put a, like a, my chalkboard that I had, my done chalkboard that I made um, last year. So that's what I'm about to do. Kind of redecorate some stuff. like their book bag when we come in the door. The little, I need a flat tip screw. So, and I put stabilizers in it because, you know, I want it to stay up and not fall down. So I'm gonna go to the store and then when I come back, I'll finish the kitchen sweep and mop and all that stuff. So I might as well just like pick up food now. So I don't have to come back, go back out later. So. So I'm back home. I had to run to the store and get a couple things. I didn't think I was gonna get this much stuff. I stopped by Lidl, one of my favorite stores ever. And I just wanted to show you guys what I got. Quick grocery haul. So I got these baby cucumbers. They were 99 cents on sale. Avocados, steak. Bread, the bread was like 65 cents, y'all. And also they have name brand stuff too. So I got these mac and cheese, quick heat up things. Y'all, they had king crab legs. Um, and it's quite a few of them, $19. I don't think you can get two big, 
legs at Sam's for like $30. This was $19. Lidl, y'all. Yes, bomb. These were like $5 for the jumbo shrimp. Got shredded cheese, uh, ketchup, balsamic vinegar. And I got these for the kids and letting them try for their lunch. Then I got some kiwis. They were really cheap, like $1.20. And then I got mushrooms. I love baby arugula. Um, I love this, so I like this for my salad. So I got these right here. Um, Ziploc bags, ice cream, sour cream, almond milk, and y'all, yes. Y'all see all those? Those are like $2 a piece, right? Crazy. My son, he likes pepperoni sandwiches for lunch. So that's what I got, pepperoni slices. And I got chicken. This chicken was really affordable. It's $4, $6 for like chicken breast and stuff. So if y'all ain't hit a little yet, y'all missing some, something good. like. Little is the ish, okay? Stuff is like half the price of Walmart, or not half the price, but kind of like a quarter of the price off of Walmart, and definitely half the price of Target. So y'all need to hit up Little. And those wines, they be having sales like uh, $2, $2.99, so I just get like a whole bunch to fill up my wine rack, so yeah. So yeah, y'all hit up Little. So let me finish my, um, put my kitchen together so y'all can see the final look and put up this food and stuff. So yeah, I will be back to show you the final look. So hey y'all, this is after the kids are already in bed so I guess I should be quiet and I already ate dinner, just loaded the dishwasher. So now I can finish up the kitchen and what I'm doing in here. So I'm just about to mop and well, sweep and mop, and then I'll do a complete overview of the kitchen. Elmo got me this Bona mop thing. And it's supposed to have like the spray bottle to it, but I don't know where it is. So what I do is I use this, um, oops, I use this um, microfiber thing and I put cleaner on it and do all that good stuff. So that's what I'm about to do now. I'm using one of my favorite scents. It's the Mr. Clean, gain scent and i got this from the christmas tree shop they be having random cleaners and stuff so that's a good store to get like discounted cleaners and stuff like that so if you have one of those in your area go check them out Um, I realized like the bottom of my stove is kind of dirty like that drawer down there like I'm gonna wipe that down and then We can do an overview once this floor dries it probably take a few minutes for that Yeah, it'll probably take a few minutes for the floors to dry but I gotta clean the bottom of that stove That's that's getting to me. I Finished I think I'm done She's complete She's ready. Y'all ready to see it? Well, I'm gonna give it a few more minutes. Let the floors dry a little bit. So, yeah. Floors are not completely dry, but I'm gonna go ahead and do this kitchen um, 
look see because I'm finished for now um, it's gonna be like this until something until I move I guess I don't know but uh yeah I am ready for y'all to see it so we're gonna start with the top of the cabinet um, when I was unpacking like my first week I had like all this Ray Dunn stuff all over my counter tops and stuff and I had some I had to put it somewhere until I got everything together so what I did was I put it on the top of the counter or the top of the cabinet and they, it's actually cute up there so I just kind of just left it up there so here you go Okay guys, so that's it for the kitchen. Unpack clean. Tell me what colors you suggest for like floor mats or maybe one runner. You think I should get like a, a runner for the floor that matches kind of the dining room rug? I think that's something that I'm looking for. Or do you think it should be another color, gray? Um, if you haven't noticed, I have a whole lot of neutrals in my house right now black white gray uh tans i kind of like the neutrals right now so that's what i'm gearing towards so let me know should i get floor mats kitchen floor mat or just one runner and if um whatever colors i get just suggest some colors that i can go with as far as floor mats for the kitchen but i really appreciate you guys for watching and I will see y'all in the next unpack video. I might as well take y'all to every room since I'm unpacking, you know? Bye. I pray and hope they loving up. Man, we got so many kids. I just hope they loving up. We gonna set the tone and the stand and hope they notice us. Vlogging all day and all night because this brings us peace. Jibu got our back, she help us live and she help us see.